Hey guys, back at it again. So today I'm going to do the 10 minute everyday makeup challenge. First I start off with my Master Prime by Maybelline Primer. I'm going to take that and just rub it all over my face. Rub it in to get my face nice and ready to do my makeup. Before I do this step I do moisturize, um, but I did that before I started filming. So I just rub this all in, and then next I'm going to go in with the Magic Star Concealer. This is in the shade C6. I do put this under my eyes, on my nose, in between my eyebrows, um, my upper lip, and then on my chin. So I'm going to do that. And then I'm going to just blend it in with my brush. Blending, blending, blending. Uh, this look I'm going to do is really easy. Like I said, it's an everyday look. Um, super quick to do. I do pack on the concealer because I am a mom of three. So I have some bags <laughs> under my eyes. Um, so I get all that blended in real good. Next, I'm going to go in the, with the Maybelline Fit Me and do a smooth. It's in the shade Classic Ivory. So I just kind of swipe it all over my face here with my brush, slop some all over the place. <laughs> um, really no rhyme or reason, just kind of get product on my face. And then I go back in with my brush and just blend it real well. Blend, blend, blend. I love this foundation so much. This is one of the products that like I don't go for the high end stuff because this works just fine for me. You can get it any drugstore, Walmart, Target, Amazon, all over the place. I like it a lot. It's been my go to for years. So just blend that all in till I'm happy with it. Get my neck a little bit. Definitely got some up in my hair a little bit ago and <laughs> it stays there the whole video. Don't do that. Next I go back in with the Magic Star Concealer in the shade C6. Like I said, I do have pretty bad um, circles under my eyes, so I do like to just pack on the concealer. <laughs> so just do under my eyes when I go in the second time. And I almost do like a light blend with this. I don't blend it as harshly as I do the first time going in with it. Through my nose a little bit and my forehead. Next, I'm going to go in with the translucent translucent powder. Um, it's Jeffree Stars. I don't like to um, bake because I find that when I do bake... I tend to get a lot of creasing under my eyes, so I kind of just like throw it on, get it all in my eyeballs. <laughs> um, but yeah, just put it on and then kind of just like blend it in right away. Get it all over the place. Just set what I just did. Next, I go in. This is the Wet n Wild um, Photo Focus Foundation. 
I'm not quite sure the shade, but it's just a dark. Um, I use it for my contour, and it works just fine. So eventually I will get <laughs> an actual contour stick, but for now, this works for me. So that's what I use. Do it on my cheeks, my forehead, and my nose, and then I'm going to just blend that in real quick. I don't um, put any on my jawline. I kind of just like blend it in once I have some product on my brush into my jawline. I find if I put it on my jawline, it looks a little too harsh. So I stopped doing that. I just blend it in like you just seen. Then blend in on my nose. Get that all blended nice. Next, I go in with the Maybelline Master Color. Um, it's a three-pack. I think it had contour in it that it was all used. I just use it for my blush. Um, I find that blush don't really last a whole lot on your face, so I don't really invest in an expensive blush. So just quickly do that and blend it in. Next, I go in with the Milani Eyebrow Gel. This is in the shade Dark Brown. This is probably the longest part of this routine. It's just getting my eyebrows filled in the way that I like them. So I'm just going to fill those in now. Real quick. You know, some days I have good eyebrow days and some days I have bad. I don't really know what's up with that because I use the same products every day. Um, I honestly think it boils down to keeping up with my eyebrows and making sure they're nice and touched up. Uh, otherwise, I look like I have giant messy eyebrows. <laughs> they didn't turn out too bad today. So I'm just going to go ahead and do the other one. I used to be terrible at doing eyebrows, but I'm slowly getting better. I wouldn't say I'm perfect by any means. Like I said, I do have my good and bad days when it comes to doing them. So I'm just about done now with these. All done. I'm happy with them. Next, I'm going to go in with the Conspiracy Palette. I'm only using two eyeshadows out of this for this look. Um, maybe next time I can try to do like a more like going out look. But for this, this is just an everyday look. So I'm going to go in with Diet Root Beer here. With my new Harry Potter brushes. I love them so much. I got them off Amazon. So I'm just going to go in my crease here with this. Um... I'm not like super neat with it just because you get it in your crease and then you can blend it how you want. Um, if you're in a rush and you only have so long to do your makeup, it's not a huge deal to be super perfect with it as long as you just get it blended to where it don't look super messy. So I'm just going to blend that real quick. Get it all blended. Oh, I lie. I do. I use three shades out of this palette, not just two. I use two browns, though. So that I go in with my crease with. And then next, I'm gonna go in. I don't remember the shade. <laughs> um, it's right next to the Diet Repair. It's just a lighter, like a tan color. I, oh, it's Tana. I think it's Tanacon or Tana Tanacon, something like that, maybe. So I just do my lid with that, and then I'm going in with Ranch under my brows, just to give that a little pop there. And I am done with shadows. Okay, next I'm going to go in with my L'Oreal Mascara. I'm not exactly sure the specific one it is. Um, I honestly just ran out recently, and... <laughs> scooped that up off Amazon just because I was out so it's a new one to me and I do really like it 
does a good job. Normally I like uh, wearing false lashes, but lately I've kind of just, I'm trying to let my eyelashes um, grow and just <laughs> be a little bit better because when you wear false lashes every single day, it does do some damage to your eyelashes. So I've kind of just been going with the mascara lately. Next, I'm going in with the Jeffree Star Celebrity Skin Velour Liquid Lip. This is one of my favorite shades. I absolutely love it. This and Christmas Cookie are probably my two go-to nude lips from him that I have. But this one most definitely is my more go-to. I mean, I, I could wear this one every day and be happy. I will definitely be buying this again for sure. So I'm just going to do my lips here. Get them all nice. I do um, overdo them just a little bit. Um, nothing too crazy. Because I do have naturally decent size lips. So now I'm going in with Sarcophagus from the 24 Karat Highlight Palette from Jeffree Star. I'm just going to put that in my inner corner. Kind of give me a little bit of pop right there. Do it on my nose and a little bit in between my eyebrows. So I'm just doing a little highlight on my nose and in between my eyebrows like I said. Um, sometimes I'll do my cheeks and then some days I won't. I also do some a little there on my lip. And that is the look, you guys, in 10 minutes. I mean, probably just over 10, but I was also showing you guys all the products. Thank you so much for watching. See you in the next one. Bye, guys.